<laughs> you roll your eyes at my dreams and my thoughts, quick to give help, but even quicker to throw it in my face. Make me feel like I'm just another lost soul, at least I'm trying to claw my way out of this dull, meaningless life and do what will make my heart sing. Can't keep being concerned with what you're thinking, because while you're waiting around for me to stumble and fall, make another mistake, take a step back, lose my way, I'm beating the, these devils off my own back, trying to get my life on a better track. But all you hold on to is my past and mishaps, all the while I'm trying to let it, gl let it go. So you bring it up and I'm tired of taking the blows. Sorry you feel cheated and expect me to fail. Your negativity is stealing the wind from my sails. So I'll leave the wind behind and jump overboard. My, des my destiny is my own to write, and I need to write more. So I'll pick myself up off this unforgiving floor. I've done it before. This time I won't take your hand. Don't need to be reminded how I've spoiled my plans. But they haven't gone bad, they've just changed like me. And if you stop the judgment from spewing from your lips long enough to see all the steps I'm taking despite the bullshit I'm facing, because I'm tired of being used as your inspiration to frown, so I'm def desperately trying to leave this town. The longer I stay here, the more time you'll waste trying to mold me into a more familiar shape instead of letting me be me, do what makes my soul feel free. You've known me my whole life, but how much do you really know? Teaching me not to let my pain show? Storing memories? unpleasant in boxes in your mind, threatened when I try to find, how to put into words what's been done, instead of being like you and leaving the unresolved behind. I'm tired of acting like everything is okay. This is life. There's never an easy way. And my honesty scares you more than my two years of near silence, but giving life to my past so it doesn't destroy me, recognizing my mistakes but not letting them define me. Not proud of all the smudges on this piece I'm trying to create, but it's the imperfections that make it original. I'll take responsibility for them all. I'm tired of blaming them on this inconsistent concept of fate. I wasn't destined to fall for that boy my first month in the real world, but it happened, just like the solid blue lines that followed a few months behind. So I made a choice, though it was his voice that sounded louder than mine. When grief and self-blame cast a gray sky, oblivious to him, whiskey clouding his mind, I acquired a taste for the poison myself. Swallowing pills with sips of vodka for good measure, longing to numb out the pain, fuck pleasure. This tainted mindset, blinded by regret, I started running the wrong way, down the one-way street before me. Desperate attempts to get him to stay, couldn't stand to be alone to face another day. By stay, he did not, and I kept staggering along, couldn't tell the bar apart from my own damn home. My acting skills were perfected, convincing you I had it together. Never let on what I'd never accepted. When I did finally tell you the burden I was still holding, at my lowest point, my heart folding, your response was to stop talking as if my words held power to prevent healing. But the chapter didn't go away. I brought it here with me today. I used my own knife to etch it into my soul. And the point of this wasn't for my story to be told. That was just the background. In the past, I'm no longer bound. But because life happened, I didn't land where originally planned. I'm finally starting to map out this life. And for once in years, I feel like I'm found. I can stop staring at the ground, choosing instead to stare down this new road I've picked out that would have stayed unnoticed if I hadn't gotten lost for a few years. If this map hadn't been washed clean with my tears, now is there is a choice that you need to face. Follow me down this new path I'm choosing, or remain with my footsteps in this miserable place. Whoa!